Welcome one and all to the Witch's Cauldron Prologue. My name is Deep Space Matt, and today my fire is roaring, my ingredients prepped, and my door always open. As townsfolk file in looking for solutions to their problems, I'll need to experiment with ingredients to find new potions and recipes. I can decide whether to help or hinder them to avoid either becoming too suspicious or too famous. Can I prevent myself from being burnt at the stake? Let's find out in the Witch's Cauldron. Alright, here we go with the Witch's Cauldron prologue. This is a narrative a roguelike in which I'm going to be brewing potions and hoping that I don't get burned at the stake. Now, the full game is set to release on January 24th, but the prologue here is available for free. You can download it now and try it yourself if you want to check it on out. Or the full game, I will have links in the description down below where you can do just that. But for now, let's get right into it with a new game. Oh, here we go. Look at us, our, our little witch and our little cat here. Here's our new home. Check that everything's in order before visitors start coming. Open the book, select the love potion, and put the required ingredients into the cauldron. Okay, let's take a look at the UI first. Looks like we have a... Like, oh yes, a timer up here, a visitor patience timer, how many of your brewing attempts and they can handle. We have a, a day cycle, we have no money whatsoever. What's down here? The measure of people's dread. The measure of your fame. Okay, I'm guessing that we want to increase our fame while decreasing our dread. Uh, and, oh, we have like different, different ingredients here. Wild root, bat wing, snake fang, nettle leaf. Nightshade, Toadstool, Amanita, and Rat's Tail, and looks like two other ones that uh, we don't have yet. Uh, I think that's everything, so let's take a look at our book here. This is your magic book. Take your time to browse all of its sections, then click on the potion to highlight the required ingredients. To close the book, click outside of it. You can also toggle the book with space and flip the pages with A and D. Sounds great. We have a love potion, love in a bottle, open with, <laughs> open with a screw. Hexing potion, inflicts misfortune, weakens health, did you just spill it on yourself? Healing, healing elixir, oh we might need that after using the hexing potion. Cures all, maybe even broken heart. And this is available in the full, full version and more stuff in the full version. We have other recipes, uh, which we don't have. Experiments, all blank. Ingredients. Oh, look at this, Agaricus, in the full version, Amanita. The finest Amanitas can only be found on Witch's Nose, known only to a chosen few. Tis a solitary cape that stretches far into a cold sea, yet somehow its meager soil bears fruit, or should we say shroom, and what fine specimens are those? They must be picked on the tenth day of Juno's month, before the tide swallows the narrow strip of land between the nose and the shore. Amanitas contain dreadful powers and can make one like a bird. Requires a gentle touch unless one wants to end up with a face full of warts after drinking a fly potion. I like the, um, the whole naturalist sketchbook look of this. It's great. Oh, we have, okay, we have a lot of text. Serpens and Chiroptera. Urtica and Belladonna. Radis Mandragora, Gramine and Verosa. Uh, looks like that's it here. I wouldn't mind if the the font here on the text looked more like maybe like this font here on the, on the far left. Just something to make it look a little more like handwritten in this book. But otherwise, I love this. This is great. Uh, let's we gotta select our love potion here, which uses Snake Fang, Nightshade, and Toadstool. And there they are. Snake Fang, uh, Nightshade, yep, and Toadstool. I don't think we it matters if we do it in order. <laughs> Love Potion, uh, give it away or try it again. Uh, uh, give it away, I suppose. Oh, hello. I slipped in the sauna the other day and hit my head real hard. It got myself a splitting headache and I'm seeing some weird shadows everywhere too. Give me something for my pain. Whether you do right or wrong, it will affect your fame. This person will give you money for your help. Oh, so we can give you the right thing or we can give you the wrong thing. Okay, well, uh, I got something to heal your pain. I got a healing elixir right here.
Uh, there you go, my good sir. Uh, oh yeah, there we go. It went, uh, our fame went up. The world balance has changed. The scales at the bottom of the screen measure your fame and the people's dread. They should not reach their ends lest something terrible happen. Oh, we don't want our fame to go all the way up? We, oh, we don't, want to be, we don't want to be too famous. We don't want to draw attention to ourselves. Oh, okay. Well, uh, we're, we're getting higher and famous. Let's hope this town will treat us better than the last one and we won't cross anybody. Maybe a cup of tea to get us going. Mix nettle leaves and nightshade, then add some roots for the aroma. Okay. Uh, nettle, right? Nettle leaves. This was the nightshade. And is this the root? Yeah, this is the root. Oh, look at that. We made green tea. Does that show up in our book now? Each potion consists of three different ingredients. You can try any combination and see the result. Failed combinations are also recorded in your book. Oh, that's great. Rumors say a witch moved into the old hut on the edge of the forest. What? No, that's crazy talk. That's, uh, are we, oh man, we're increasing by five fame? Oh no. All right, day two here. I'm the famous artist. Lately, the joy of creation just hasn't been there anymore, as if life and beauty simply vanished from my paintings. Maybe there's something I can mix with my paints to make them better. Will give me money and will affect my fame. Oh, we got five from that last guy. I don't have any... Man, I don't, I don't think I have anything to mix with paints. Uh, oh, it did. Look, the green tea came in here on the other recipes. Um, so I guess we have to... I guess we have to experiment and just throw things together to find other recipes. All right, well, let's, uh, okay, hold on. Can we do this, like, methodically? Like, if we do wild root, bat wing, and snake, is that something? Wild root and bat is nothing so far. So, uh, just across the top here. Oh, that does not look good. You brewed nothing useful. No, try again. Oh, and we lost, we lost some patience. Visitors have some patience. It is displayed by blue circles in the upper part of the screen. Each circle represents one of your brewing attempts. When all of the circles are gone, the visitor will be gone too. So use your attempts wisely. Okay, uh, so we did these. So let's go root bat. Oh, what is this? Nettle? Bat nettle. Oh, that's something. A sleeping potion? That's not going to help you. But if we try again, we're going to lose the patience and we'll be down to one and we have to make something. So let's <laughs> let's just give you a sleeping potion. Uh, no, let's, uh, let's try again. Oh, and there it shows up. That's great. Okay, what is good for let's, uh, healing? We're going to heal your paints. This probably won't work, but there you go. At least our fame won't go up by helping her. Oh, hello. Is it you again? Can't thank you enough for curing my headaches, although I'm still having visions and seeing furtive shadows. Heard there is a forest berry that's very good for the eyes. Do you happen to have it? Um, no. I have a healing potion. Uh, oh, wait. Is that in the... Does it state anywhere in here? Any of these help with the eyes? The Amanita we read. Nothing about eyes in there. Serpents... Chiroptera, Urtica, let's see, I uh, believe Nettles have a mind of its own, causes insanity, no, not good, none of these ingredients are good, uh, poison their minds, powers are hidden, uh, you'll become pale like a worm, yeah, not that one, Ratus, no, not the rat, Graminae, Fumes alone caused unconsciousness can be found in grain fields. Keep their properties for a long time. Uh, served rich witches in their evil deeds. A numbing balm. Uh, risk losing fingers and toes to their teeth. Okay, yeah, I don't see anything about any of that. Okay, let's uh, go back to experimentation. We made this sleep potion... Okay, what were we doing here? We did this, this, we did root bat and nettle. So now we do root a bat and nightshade. Oh, that's something. A viral chowder. 
Can I look at this before I decide to give it away? Very popular. It's a very popular chowder. Uh, try again. Uh, root, bat, toadstool. Nope, that's nothing. Okay, you know what? We are going to... Wait, are you going to give me money? No, this is just for fame. So you know what? Maybe we just put a hex on you? Or actually... You're having visions. Let's put you to sleep, you know? You can't have visions if you're asleep. Well, I mean, I guess you can have nightmares. That's probably bad, too. And, oh, does our... It said our failed attempts. Is that what experiments is? Oh, it is. Look at this. Okay. So we did those three. We did that and the toadstool. So now we're on to this and the Amanita. But what do you need? I want to put my horse on a race. Got one really strong competitor, though. I want to weaken his horse. As a reward, I would give you my grandma's special recipe. She was a real beauty, she was. We'll get money, and this will affect our dread. But, oh, I want that recipe. Free recipe? Yes. Okay, but let's, uh, we have three available, so we can experiment twice here. So it's root, bat, amanita. That's nothing. Uh, root, bat, and rat's tail that's okay so root and bat we've tried everything with root and bat so now we do root and snake right and move along down the line but we need to give him something we need to give him a hexing potion this should you do the job we'll take some dread that's okay that's okay we're still fine on to day three the owner of the winning horse stumbled into your hut early in the morning, overflowing with the drink and gratitudes you could barely shake the promised recipe out of him. As told in his own words, add a mashed death cap to nettle deduction, decoction, then oh god my head is killing me I'm gonna pee. Or I'm gonna pass out maybe and then he just passed out. Um, okay so death cap and nettle, but we don't know what the third thing is so we just gotta test for the third thing and it'll make this. An ecclesiastical troop visited the capital and performed their renowned mysteries. The spectators were given bread and wine, kindly provided by the bishop. The performance aimed to remind the sinful crowd the price of their souls. Piety will increase in people and they will forget about you, for a while, until the urge to poison the neighbor's cattle or lure his, wife's takes, lure his wife takes over again. Oh, minus five fame, that's great. Thank you for that. Okay. I come again asking for your help. My head is okay, thanks, yet I still see little black spots like mice scuttling around. It bothers me a great deal. Help me clear my sight. I'm trying, dude. I don't, I gotta experiment more. You're not giving me enough patience here. Uh, what was my last experiment? Okay, this and bat. So, okay, so we did everything with the bat. Or with the root and the bat. So now it's onto root and this. Although we do have that half recipe with the nettle and the toad, was it the net? Oh no, now I don't remember. Oh shoot, what was it? It was, it was nettle. I can't remember was it was, toadstool or amanita. Okay, we're gonna continue with our experimentation though. So, root and bat, we're gonna do root, snake. Oh wait a minute, this already makes something? Do we already have something with root and snake? I gotta make sure, I'm gonna... No, we don't. Okay, a root snake and nettle. Oh, it makes something. Rejuvenation potion? Oh, maybe this will help you. What does this say on it? A cider from a very special apples. Okay. That might rejuvenate your sight? Okay, but next up, we got, we got another experiment here. We have root, snake, and nightshade. Nope, that's nothing. Okay, uh, now we need to give you this rejuvenation potion. Enjoy. Hopefully that helps. Or maybe it doesn't. I didn't notice what it was going to increase. Oh, this is fame and dread. Greetings, O oh witch. Care to help? I've lost my voice, which is absolutely disastrous with me being a town crier. Thought it was a common cold, but medicine doesn't help. Oh no. 
Okay, well, it's going to increase either one. So I guess the healing elixir is what we want, right? However, we still want to experiment. So we did... And the nightshade. So we're on to root, snake, and toadstool. Nothing. Uh, root, snake... Oh, will the rat's tail do the job? Oh, I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, thank you, cat. You're amazing. At jelly in the tail. Oh my, what is this? A Thanksgiving special. Thanks, God. Oh, oh no, not not for me. I guess for the cat. The cat really wanted me to make this. He was hungry. That's what he wants. He wants uh, a rat in in jello. Okay, no, we're gonna we're not giving that to you. We're going to give you the healing elixir. This will increase our fame, which is not great. But it decreased our dread. Uh, oh, hello, you. Look at you. This is not good. Oh, yeah, it's not. And don't fool around. I know what you're up to. You will burn in a holy fire or in hell. You will burn. Now, what do you have in that cauldron? Oh, we got question marks here. I have, uh, I have a hexing potion, my man. I got a hexing potion just for you. Or maybe I have a jelly in the tail for you. Uh, let's do, let's, we got to experiment. We got one more to do with the root. Oh, you only have two patients. The snake and the amanita. Okay, that's nothing. Okay, so root, bat, and root and snake, we've done everything. And now we're going to hex you. We're going to hex you bad. Oh, no. Oh, no. We've just messed up. A loud voice from the town square woke you up. It praised oh-so-kind and wonderful healer who lives nearby. Nice words from the town crier, but couldn't he wait for five more minutes? They say the bandits are raiding the local forests. They are well organized and equipped, ripping off the nobles and helping the common folk. The king's soldiers and huntsmen claimed that every one of those bastards is going to hang. Oh, jeez. Oh, we made a mistake. Tabula reincarnations. The fire. You're the most famous witch for miles around. You couldn't stay drunk on your new fame for too long, however. The church took notice and decided to put an end to this blasphemous abomination by ending your life. Oh, man. Well, look at all these other things, too. So that, yeah. So that's, we've got one ending, and we have multiple other ones. And over here with the cat, what is all that? Okay, we gotta try this again. Just start back. Okay, good. Oh, look at us! Welcome back again. It feels like we've been through it already. As they say, do what you ought to, come what may, peruse the book. It remembers. Let's get brewing. Oh, we have all our recipes? We have all our recipes. That is amazing. Okay, okay. We're, we're back at it again. Uh, oh no, but everything's moved around. I was doing this in order. Oh, shoot. Uh, okay. Uh, let's get brewing. Sure. Uh, oh, it's down here now. Okay, well, I guess we are... <laughs> I guess we're starting off with... What were we doing? We're doing root, right? It was starting with a root. We did root and bat. We did root and snake, right? And we did everything for those. So let's just go down here. We're going to go root. We're going to go nettle. And we're going to do nightshade. Oh, oh, that's already something we knew. Okay, give it away. Green tea, that's fine. What do we got here? I'm an innkeeper. My inn is always full of guests. One thing bothers me. A fairy ring grew in the middle of my mushroom plot. All those disgusting toadstools and death caps got anything to destroy it. You will give me money? I, I don't have anything to destroy that. A hexing potion, maybe? Uh, this does not affect my fame or my dread, which is good. Uh, let's start uh, experimenting. We got root. We got nettle. We got amanita. That's nothing. Uh, root. Nettle. And toadstool is also nothing. All right, let's try this hex. Let me just make sure here. Oh, it doesn't keep the experiments, though. 
Hexing Potion. Try to put a hex on the, the fairies, although I would say don't mess with the fairy folk. I am beset by demons. Every night a succubus comes to torture and abuse me. I can barely feel my body in the morning. What are you saying? Banish her? Are you nuts? Just make me able to endure it. Oh my. So increase our dread, but we will get money. Oh, we have no money left. Um, oh wait, is this... Okay, is the money our win condition then? Because it's out of 200. If we get to 200, do we win? So this appears our win condition, and the two on the bottom are our uh, fail failure conditions. That might be it. Uh, let us experiment, right? We were doing root and nettle, I believe. Root, nettle. And we did everything else except for the rat's tail, I want to say. Oh, let's go. Let's not go. That's already something. I guess I got to pay attention to the notebook here of what we have. Okay, so Root and Nettle, done everything there. Get Brewing, take Amanita, Nightshade, and Toadstool. Is that something? Uh, Amanita, Toadstool, Nightshade. Wait, what? Did I just do that right? Amanita, Nightshade, and Toadstool. Do I have to do it in that order? Okay. Amanita. Nightshade. Oh, it's already in there, down here on the bottom. And Toadstool. Oh, what are you doing to me, cat? What are you doing? Um, okay, what, what, uh, you know what? Sleeping. You're gonna be asleep. You, you'll be able to endure it then, I'm sure. There you go. Oh no, maybe that was wrong. Our, our dread went down. Uh, nightfall. The air is crisp. The breeze brings the smell of fresh hay. A beautiful morning promises an equally pleasant day. Nothing bad can happen when the weather's this fine, right? Of course not. And look at that. Our, our dread goes down. Hello, sweetheart. I'm worried for my pigeons. They lose their way while carrying the mail or refuse to fly at all. Got anything to perk them up? Okay, this will increase our fame. Which is bad, but we get money, and we need money to win the game. Alright, uh, what have we been doing? Nightshade and Nettle. Which we've done everything, I think, with, if I remember. Or am I not? Man, I'm losing it. The, the fact that everything moved, the ingredients all moved around, completely messed me up. Uh, we did Nightshade, Nettle, Deathcap, Nightshade, Net Nettle, and Toadstool. So we still need to do it with the rat. Nightshade, Nettle, Rat. Oh, no, that's the heal- oh my gosh. That's why. That's why. Um, here, the healing elixir will certainly perk them up. You know, let's try again. We, we have one more experimentation. Okay, now we're on to- well, I'm trying to do it in the order that they, they were before. We have this, plus this. Oh, I gotta check. So, Root and Nightshade. Uh, do I have anything that's already root and nightshade? I no, not there. Uh, oh, here root nightshade nettle. Root nightshade bat. That's fine. We're not doing that. We're doing root nightshade and these three across the top. So amanita is nothing. All right, let us give. Uh, we want to rejuvenate them. Let's try the rejuvenation potion. Is that something that is working? Maybe? I don't know, it didn't move any of the meters. Pardon for bothering you, my eyes are not as good as they used to be. What magnificent smells come out of this place? Can I get a taste of something? Sure, you can get a taste of something. Ooh, question marks. Um, we're gonna experiment though with root uh, nightshade and toadstool. Nope. Uh, root, nightshade, and rat's tail. No. Okay, so that's everything. That should be everything with root and nightshade. Now we just have these three across the top. 
Uh, okay, you want something to eat that is good. Viral chowder is very popular. I mean, maybe we just give you green tea. Green tea is great. You know what? Can't go wrong with that. I'm not so sure about giving you a rat in jello. Or fame went down. That's interesting. Tough crowds in the local taverns lately. Brew me something I can slip into a beer barrel to make the folks more appreciative of my talents and easily parting with their money. You're going to give me money for this. I've not been doing anything right uh, so far. I've not been doing anything right so far. Okay, we're going to do Root Amanita Toadstool. Oh, what is this? Sporadic Goo? What is that? Be unpredictable. Use it with imagination. Is that what I need to give to you? Maybe. We have one more we can experiment with. Root Amanita Rat's Tail. Nothing. Okay, let's try the sporadic goo. Uh, oh, it increased our fame, so maybe that worked. Maybe that was the right one. Someone's left a present at your door. The note says your help was most satisfactory. It seems the past is catching up with you. We get seven gold. Let's go. We're up to twelve. I have a pest problem. This damn bard keeps bothering me and my guests with his silly songs and pranks. I want him to forget my tavern even exists. I don't have anything for that. Okay, but we do need to do what root, toadstool, and rat. Okay, I think that's everything with the root. So we've done everything with the bat, everything with the root, everything with the root, everything... Oh, now I'm messing up what I've done stuff with. Uh, so now we're on to the bat? Did I... Yeah, I was going with the root across the top, and the bat was the next one. So let's go bat. We don't want to touch the root, because we've done everything with the root. Uh, nettle. Oh, will the snake fang do the... Oh, okay. Uh, please tell me you're telling me the right thing here. Oh, it is. What is this? Hot spice. You can shower it on your enemies during a siege. All right, let's try again. Uh, we're doing bat, nettle, and nightshade. That is nothing. Uh, oh, that was your last patience. The blacksmith keeps beating me up when he's drunk. I swear he's going to murder me one of these days. Help me curse him and just make it not too deadly. I wouldn't want to kill him. Heard you could go to hell for that. Okay. Uh, we're going to get money for this, and we're going to get some dread, but our dread is kind of low, so I think we want to do this. But we do want to experiment. What have I been doing so far? Okay, so we need bat, nettle, and amanita up here. Nothing. Uh, bat, nettle, toadstool. Also nothing. A bat, a nettle, and a rat's tail. Okay, so that's everything that's bat and nettle. Now we have to do bat and nightshade. But we do want to curse. Put a hex. There we go. Give that to you. Alright, that's good. That's good, because we need money. A tree fell the wrong way. I barely dodged it, but still got hit pretty bad. I think my ribs are cracked. We're going to get money from this. Uh, that's a healing potion, right? We have two that we can experiment with. So we're doing bat... Was it bat and nightshade? Yeah, we're doing bat and nightshade. Bat, nightshade. Will the snake fang do that? Hold on, hold on. This is not something I, I have to... I have to make sure I got to look. Uh, we're doing bat and nightshade. Anything that's already... Oh yeah, bat, nightshade, root. That's fine. We're not doing that. Okay. Snake fang. Oh, look at that. A pick-me-up potion. What does that do? Dark brown liquid. It smells delicious. Picks you up. Oh, it's got an eye on it. Oh, is this for the eyesight? Oh, this is the guy who couldn't have trouble with his eyes? 
Oh, if only we knew that before. But I guess we'll know it for future runs. Oh, that's excellent. Oh, I love this already. This is great. Okay. Um, what was this? This was Bat, Nightshade, and Snake. So now we got to do Bat, Nightshade, and these three across the top. Bat, Nightshade, Amanita. Nothing, but now we don't want to run out of patience. So let's give you a healing potion. Here you go. Very nice. We got some money. We got a long ways to go. Summer ends and autumn comes. When the last leaf falls, the boundaries between the worlds weakened. For three days and three nights, the souls of the dead wander the earth and visit their still living kin. Evil spirits come along as well. All the God-fearing people spend these days in prayer from dusk till dawn. Gravekeepers stand vigil and sanctify the cemeteries to drive away the evil. Oh no, the dread is... that's not my fault. I didn't have anything to do with that. I was a chaplain once, and now I tend to the graves and drink at my pleasure. Life was good, it was, until a vile demon came for my soul last night. I'm lost until I fool him thrice. Help, I can't help you. I need to take down my dread. Or do I help you? Oh, now I don't know. If I don't help you, the demon gets you. Does that increase dread? Oh, no. Okay, where were we at? Um... We had... Oh, jeez. Look at all this stuff we've been doing. We're on Bat and Nightshade, right? I think I did Bat, Nightshade, and Manita last. Even though it doesn't... Bat Nettle. Was I doing Bat Nettle? I didn't think so. Uh, wait a minute. We made a... No, I was definitely doing Bat, Nightshade. Because you made the pick-me-up. Okay, Bat... Nightshade. Toadstool. Nope. Uh, bat. Nightshade. Oh, rat's tail. That's what I was just trying to do. What is this? A chameleon potion. Become one with the wall. No one will see you coming. Oh, I mean, that's this is what you need, isn't it? You have to fool him. This will fool him. But we don't want that. We want to... What do we want to do that will mess with you and not work? Rejuvenate? Pick you up? Uh, maybe just some, some... Some green tea. The green tea. There you go. It's bound to not help you at all. Alright. Ah, I was told you were making exquisite drinks here. I want to try something unique. We'll get money from this, but it'll increase our fame. I, I'm scared after last time. Our fame went up super high, super fast. Okay, we can experiment. We tried Bat and Nightshade, I believe, with everything. And we've already done the snake and these two. So now it's Bat with the stuff across the top. Bat, Toadstool. Oh no, Bat, Amanita, and Rat's Tail. Okay. Oh, Cat... Cat, Bat, Amanita, Toadstool. Or, you know, what if we just... Man, I do want to get the money up. Maybe we're okay. Maybe we're okay. Let's... Let's do this. Let's, uh, make... Just make some green tea for you. Oh man, look at that. We got like 20 gold out of that. Your potion was useless. The fairy ring is still there. Let's try something else before they start growing on my body. Alright, um... Man, where are we at? I have no clue where I'm at on my experimentation. I was trying to do it methodically. But it doesn't... Where? Where's the stuff I was just doing? I'm doing bat... I did like bat toadstool... Are we just all filled up? Is it not filling up more after this? Or wait a minute, what was that? Oh no, that's just the uh, the tool tip there. All right, we did we did bat with the amanita across. I think I need to do bat, toadstool, and rat, and that's the last one for the bat. All right, 
so then we did everything for root right we did everything for a bat I think snake is next I think snake is next so we'll do snake we'll do nettle we'll do wait a minute Snake, Nightshade, and Toadstool. Is Snake and Nettle anything already? Snake, Nettle, and Wild Root. Snake, Nettle, and Bat. Alright, that's fine. Snake, Nettle, and Nightshade. No. Alright, uh, something for the Fairy Ring. I don't think... Oh, maybe this one. You can shower it on your enemies during a siege. Wait a minute, what is this going to increase for me? The Dread? That's bad. Give you a love... <laughs> give you a love potion. Okay, Nightfall. Oh no, the Chaplain Gravekeeper is gone. Rumor has it that sometimes he's seen on forest roads and in the... Other in other dark places, they say that he has no eyes, his tongue is torn out, and an ugly horned monster sits on his shoulder, spitting profanities. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. We did not. Oh, look at it. An ecclesiastical troop. Okay, yes, piety with the people. Our fame goes down. Oh, but the dread is bad. We gotta get the dread down. Well met, O oh wise one. I have a pest infestation in my garden. They eat all the green stuff, the little devils. I beg for your help. I have no clue how to help you with pests. Um, we were... Jeez, oh, now a snake. We did snake, nettle, and nightshade. So snake, nettle, and manita. Nope. Uh, snake, nettle, toadstool. Oh! Oh, a beauty potion. Look at that. Oh, that's the thing. Snake, nettle, toadstool. Oh, nettle, toadstool, and it was with snake. Because that's the look of the potion that the one the one guy was going to give me the recipe for from his grandmother or something. We figured it out. It was the snake was the other thing. Okay, so that was snake, nettle, toadstool. Now we have snake, nettle, rat's tail nothing okay so we've done snake with these three now we do snake nightshade with the three across the top uh, but I have nothing nothing to help you we can do this I guess hot spice maybe maybe that's the kind of thing that's gonna help maybe, maybe not I've grown too weak and frail in my old age. It can barely lift my hammer and pump the bellows these days. Help me get my strength back, which I will. I will. <laughs> I will, Kratos, there. Because uh, hopefully if I help you, maybe the dread will go down in our, our like, daily or nightly recap sessions. Uh, but we are going to experiment. All right, we do snake nightshade now. With all of this across the top. Nope. Snake, nightshade, toadstool. Oh! Oh, we already knew this. Oh, I should have looked. I keep forgetting to look. Alright. Uh, no, I don't want to give you a love potion. Okay, snake, nightshade, and rat's tail I don't think is anything. So we have to test that one. Uh, oh, that's with, that's with the wild root. All right, so you need you need a healing potion for sure. Healing elixir. Uh, there you go. Enjoy. Yeah, the fame went up, so that was correct. I'm trying to woo a highborn lady, but her parents are hard to impress. Make me the fairest in all the land. I will do that. Uh, but we are going to use your patience to experiment. Okay, we're on Snake, Amanita. That's what I was about to try. The Toadstool. Potion of Oblivion? What does that do? Oh, what does that do? Get rid of every bad memory. Oh, how much he remains? Oh, that's... Okay. That's great. Oh, and it looks like... So it looks like a brain. Lips. Uh, face. 
eyes. Okay. Um, oh, this is great. And then we have other recipes. So these ones available in the full version, but it looks like here in the prologue, there's still one we don't know, two we don't know. So there's two potions we don't know. And like one, two, three, four recipes, it looks like, that we can still figure out. Okay, so we got the potion of oblivion. Uh, we're gonna try again. That was that was snake amanita toadstool, right? So now snake amanita and rat tail. No. So now all we need to do is snake toadstool and rat, and we've done everything with a snake. But we want to give you a love potion. There you go. Indeed. Okay, we're at 49. We're like almost there. Not quite, but we're, we're getting closer. By King's order, the next week is declared a holiday. Merchants, mummers, musicians, and magicians will come from every corner of the realm to a glorious fair to dispel your boredom and show their talents. A puppeteering troupe, personally invited by the king's brother, will show the play The Greedy Abbot and the Prince of Thieves. Oh, we get it gets rid of uh, some some dread that's amazing listen uh so we're raising this prize pig right well our neighbors got one that's twice as big as mean that beast is foul we have to get rid of it before it eats us all um okay i cannot help you with that i cannot help you with that because that's increased the dread and that is going to be bad we need to do snake toadstool and rat Ooh, a speed elixir. Oh, we're getting all the stuffs. We're getting all the stuffs. Run, run as fast as you can. Okay, we got one more... One more potion to figure out. Um, I'm not giving you a speed elixir. Okay, so we've done everything with what? The root, the bat, and the snake. So I think, if I remember correctly, those were the ones across the top. The last... When they, when they were organized the last time, and the nettle... The nettle was next, so now I do nettle and everything. So nettle, nightshade, amanita. Oh, this is probably whoa! <laughs> we made some kombucha. Oh my! Um, I don't think that's what we want to give you. Sparkling and refreshing, probably sentient too. Indeed. Uh, I should take a look at though nettle, like nettle and amanita. Does that make anything? Uh, over here. I don't think we have done anything with that yet. Okay. Try again. Wait, what was that? What do we... Now I completely forgot. That was kombucha. So there's nettle, nightshade, and amanita. So now it's nettle, a nightshade, and toadstool. Perception potion. Ooh. Probably lets you find mistakes <laughs> in this book. Uh, okay, but we need to give you something that is probably bad. If we give twice, got one that's twice as big and mean. I mean, what if we like put it to sleep or make it beautiful or make can we there's nothing we can do like make it like not mean i feel like that would be the best option like if we hex it it'll increase dread but if we could make it nice that probably wouldn't let's just put it to sleep the pig's gonna the pig's gonna rest can't be mean if it's asleep Hail, sorceress, I drank too much the other day and made a bet that I'll wrestle a bear with my bare hands. <laughs> a bear with your bare hands. And I'm a man of my word, damn it. Now all I need is something to make me stronger or more brave, at least. Oh, man. Okay, we want to help you, right? Because if we help you, it'll increase our fame. But if we don't help you and you end up getting mauled by a bear, uh, I'm pretty sure that'll increase the dread. So we need to figure out where I was. I did... Nettle, Nightshade, and Toadstool last, I want to say. So Nettle, Nightshade, and Rat's Tail is nothing. So that's Nettle and Nightshade with everything. So now we go Nettle, Amanita, Toadstool. Nope. And then Nettle, Amanita, 
rat's tail, rat pottage. Oh man, so much food. So many foods with a rat in it. Clearly better than starving to death. Well, I, I suppose so. Uh, and then we need to... So that was... Nettle, Amanita... Wait a minute, what was that? Nettle, Amanita, and the rat. Okay, so now all we need to do is Nettle, Toadstool, and the rat and see if that makes anything. But we need to give you something to make you stronger or more brave. Rejuvenation. I feel like that just makes you younger. Speed. Making you faster. Or just a healing elixir. Maybe just the healing elixir is what needs to be done. I'm hoping this is right. I guess we'll find out if at the end of the day he <laughs> we hear if he's been eaten by a bear. New laws mean we can't hunt, can't fish under the threat of lashes. I've got children to feed. Maybe something to help me climb rocks to reach bird nests. Maybe I'll steal some eggs. Interesting. Hmm. Okay, well, we need to try this. That is nothing. All right, try again. Okay, we've done all the nettle stuff, I believe. So now we're on to Nightshade. So Nightshade and the three across the top. No. Try again. Nightshade, Amanita, Rat's Tail. So now it's just Nightshade, Toadstool, and Rat's Tail. But we need to give you something now. Something to help you climb rocks to reach the bird's nest. Speed? Perhaps? Pick me up? That's ice. That's the eyes. Okay, well, let's try speed. Uh, it didn't increase the fame immediately. But maybe it'll do something here. What's it gonna give me? Oh, minus five on that? That is great. Minus five dread. The air is crisp crisp of the breeze. Oh yes, beautiful morning. No, nothing bad can happen. Nothing bad's gonna happen. Look at that. We're all A-OK -okay here. Uh, I need to be getting some money though, is what I need to be doing. So we broke into that old crypt, right? Some buffoon from the palace paid us real good for it. One problem though, this weird dry moss inside got everywhere. It itches something awful. Help. Right or wrong, it'll fix dread. I feel like if we do right, I feel like if we do wrong, it'll increase dread. So we want to do it right. So let's do this first. Rat's tail. We got hot stuff. We got some hot stuff. Is that a potion? Almost looks like a potion. Uh, but it's really just hot sauce. Open in case of joy, sorrow, or plain boredom. I don't know if any of this stuff is something we can use like for here, for itching. But probably, I wanna say healing or rejuvenation. This doesn't tell me much, cited from special apples. Okay, let's try again. So that's night, that's nightshade with everything, right? So now we're just up to these three at the top. I feel like I've been, I feel like I've missed combinations here. Uh, but let's try these three at the top. Make sure that's not something we already have. I don't think so. Starting with the Amanita. No. Okay, there's definitely some sort of com some com combinations uh, that I did not do. Uh, but let's give you some rejuvenation or just healing. It, it says it cures all. It's got to be the healing. I still feel like the rejuvenation is making you like younger or something like that. Then again, there's already the beauty potion, so maybe not. Maybe I need to do rejuvenation. What quiet, what quaint little pub? If not for a friend of mine, I would never. What do you? <laughs> what do I have on tap? I have some kombucha for you. Let's have the get have some of this.
Uh, the fame decreased. That's great, I think. Look, dear, I'm too old and no match for the young lads in the mine. Don't want them to take me for a weakling. Got any of that liquid strength? Not really. I think the rejuvenation is what you need, though. Maybe that's what it is. Make you younger, make you make you stronger like you once were. Yep, you're too old, so we're going to rejuvenate you. Give me some money. I'm at 69 now, which is nice, but we need more. There we go. That was right. Okay, nightfall. Pray we're okay. Minus 10 fame? Yes. People snort and make faces when they hear your name. Your potions didn't help them one bit. And they say the bandits are raiding the local forests. They are well organized and equipped, ripping off the nobles and helping the common folk. The king's soldiers and huntsmen claim that every one of those bastards is going to hang. Again, we... That's not great. Not great. Again, not my fault. Local lord is searching for me because me and the boys were giving his money to the poor. Help me, witch. Interesting. Um, is helping me going helping him going to increase dread or not? I mean, you look like a bandit, but you're giving you're robbing from the rich and giving to the poor, which is presumably a good thing. So let's do this. Where is it? This potion of oblivion. Make the Lord forget everything bad that's been going on. I mean, I hope I'm. I'm giving this to you, and you understand that you are to give it to the Lord and not drink it yourself. Otherwise, this could go very bad for me. Oh, no, the dread went down. Amazing. Okay, we're good. We're good. Helping people is my calling. I find that amputating the bad parts is often the best way. Not everyone agrees with me, though. Why some flat-out refuse, often violently, anything to dull their pain. Uh, this is going to increase fame. Our fame is super down. I mean, Potion of Oblivion, right? Could make them forget everything bad. I mean, Healing Potion will heal them. Sleeping Potion could put them to sleep. Let's try the try the Potion of Oblivion. They'll just forget uh, all the bad stuff. Uh, that did not do a change at all. I think that was the wrong choice. Hello, neighbor. Guess what? I finally found myself a perfect husband. Problem is, he doesn't want to leave his wife. Care to help? She doesn't appreciate him anyway. Um, I feel like helping you is bad. I feel like helping you will increase dread. So, I think I want to give you something that will not do that. Uh, you know what? You're just gonna... Oh man, I don't want to hex them though. Put them to sleep, right? That seems harmless enough. That's harmless. Okay, nightfall. Let's see how our day went. We got gold. Yes, we helped somebody. They liked it. They gave us some gold. And that was it. Amazing. Perfect. Almost halfway there. See my old boots here? More holes than leather. My feet are wet all the time, but there's a new pair waiting for me on top of the maypole. If only I had better grip to climb it. Um, is a rejuvenation potion going to help you? Maybe. I don't think anything else is going to help you. We're going to reju we're going to rejuvenate you and your grip. I mean, you have a pretty good grip there already. That did not change anything. Uh, you're going to give me money. I'm heading to a large fair, but my old horse will be having a hard time pulling all the luggage. Something to make her more lively, perhaps. I think that's rejuvenation. I gotta say, it's gotta be rejuvenation. Oh, please work and give me moolah. You did not. Whenever I drink with my father-in-law, we end up fighting. My wife says she's had enough. Any keep you, <laughs> keep you damn mouth shut brew. I just can't help myself. Um... I mean, we put her to sleep, right? Uh, I don't think anything here kind of helps. Hot stuff, maybe. We'll put her to sleep. Right? She won't be talking. She asleep. 
okay that worked but then also we don't get any money from that but maybe like during one of these nightfall ones they they send me money in the mail right a knight errant staying at the inn swore he saw a scarecrow roaming the fields at night when he finally untangled himself from the haystack he was sleeping in and donned his armor the monster was long gone all right man dread dread is getting awful last time it was fame that was doing us in now it's dread last night i was passing water behind my barn and saw someone creeping in the field tis was my scare own scarecrow spooky in it should have burned it honestly but then who will scare them crows put it to sleep mayhaps sure we'll help you put i feel like if the scarecrow is going around it's just going to increase dread over time so let's try and deal with it so it's not making people more fearful put it to sleep and we have we have fame to spare i was seeking the truth in a barrel in the mountains in swamp waters wait you were doing what tried to achieve enlightenment all in vain my wife tells me to find a job but whoever found the truth that way help me out some soup will do too oh man okay i guess we can try and help you with some chowder i'm a little worried about my fame we might have to do some bad things coming up soon it's getting high okay we're gonna have to start doing bad things I was ordered to carve a statue of the princess, didn't expect her to be so voluminous. Now I'm out of time and the work is only half done. I'll have to work night and day to avoid the noose. Save me. Ooh. Ooh. Well, I don't even know what to do for you. Pick me up, Liquid, is probably the one. Oh no, speed. That's gonna increase my fame. I'm gonna get money. This is bad. This is bad. Um, you know what? Take, uh, take some sleeping potion, I suppose. I feel like if I put him to sleep, that could increase dread as well. But this is not going to work for you. Okay, yeah, there we go. Excellent. It went down. The fame went down. That's what I was looking for. What do we got here? Oh, minus 10. A local farmer burnt his old scarecrow for no apparent reason. Some people noticed human bones in the ashes, and the rumors soon reached the Inquisition. Nothing came out of it, though. The crows sure do look happy, and you can't help but feel you've missed something important. Oh, interesting. I wonder if we did something different. We'd figure out something with the, with the scarecrow. But that's fine. We got minus 10 for our dread. A drunken man stumbles around the village, cursing your name. He falls asleep before long, leaving more than one brow raised in suspicion. Oh, that's not good either. This land is ripe with monsters of all kind. Guess I have my work cut out for me, starting with that scarecrow. Now give me something to help in battle. Glory awakes. The scarecrow is taken care of. We will, um... You know what? We're going to make you more beautiful, my man. I don't feel like increasing my my fame. Have a beauty potion. Enjoy. I have a long trip ahead of me through a thick and dark forest. I want to cross it as fast as I can, but it's hard to stay awake. Can you help? I can. You will give me money. I might do this one. It's got to be the pick me up, right? If I get money, this is what I needed. Oh, it is 101. Oh, that's amazing. You gave me like uh, 19, I think it was, coins. We are we're over halfway there. Someone's stealing my apples, but I can't catch the thieves. As soon as the sun sets, I fall asleep. Give me something to stay awake. When I catch them, I'll reward you plenty. Oh, you'll reward me? Oh, this is bad. Okay, I'm going to take a risk. I'm going to do the pick-me-up. I'm going to take a risk that's going to pay off later, and we can maybe cross somebody... Oh, that's a whole lot. Okay, please, Nightfall, please don't do something bad to me for my fame. A knight errant keeps bothering the peasants, asking whether they saw any vagrant scarecrows. Taunts and ridicule don't waver his steadfast conviction. People call him Sir Buffoon and predict he'll make a fine king's guard one day. Minus five. That's great. Oh, no, it's bad. Thanks to your potion, the merchant stayed sharp the whole way and dodged a bandit's ambush. He has paid you handsomely. Okay, we got paid handsomely. And we suffered for... Oh, jeez. Okay, that's it. We're getting burned at the stake. One bloke fell asleep on his cart and woke up in the next town over. Oh, that's the guy we put to sleep? I thought... How come that's increasing our fame? I thought that wouldn't. Oh, no. We're dead for sure. There it is. We got burned at the stake again. 
again. <laughs> oh. Okay, I wonder how we get the other ones. Church took notice. We were too famous. I took a risk there. However, you know, now that we, we go here and then we start over, we have all of our recipes. Uh, interesting. Everything... It didn't move around like last time. Which is great. Uh, welcome back. Yes, uh, the book remembers. And we get to bruise... Uh, bru bruising. Brewing. It was peruse. And that's what I, I try to combine peruse and bru brewing at the same time. Uh, I mean, there's still... Right? There's one recipe here we don't know. And... Oh yeah, just one, one recipe, and then any potions. We found all the potions, so it's just a, a singular recipe. Uh, yeah, but uh, man, this has been great. Again, this has been the Witch's Cauldron Prologue, which is available for free. You can download it now. The full game is set to release on January 24th. I will have links to both of those in the description down below. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe, and if you made it this far, thanks for watching.